From FX Empire, this is Chris taking a look at the uh, euro against the dollar. You can see we've kind of gone back and forth. There was the agreement by the 27 leaders to enter some type of federalized debt situation for the coronavirus uh, pandemic um, uh, stimulus package. And that's that's kind of a big deal considering Europe really doesn't tend to agree on anything. So that was positive, but I think it was already priced in. So the question now is, what's moving us? Well, what's moving us is the Federal Reserve and the flooding of the markets with liquidity. I think at this point, 114 is support, just as 113 and a half is. Um, if we can break 115, then I think it's a buy and hold. And the reason I say that it's likely that that's going to happen is just because I'm watching the Aussie and the Kiwi dollar um and to a lesser extent the pound why i record this now i mentioned previously i didn't like this flag i didn't like the angle um you know probably being a little too picky but uh, such is life uh at this point in time when you measure this it sends us to about 119 and a half ish maybe 119.75 so i think 120 is probably the target how long it takes to get there who knows uh, these things don't measure time. They only measure distance. Uh, but at this point, I think above 115, it's a long-term trend change. So that would certainly be viable.